Uh, Welcome, everyone. This is the 20th of December. It's the Jenkins Platform Special Interest Group meeting. Topics that I've got on the agenda include open action items, moving the platform SIG mailing list, required Java 11 and Java 17 support. Are there any other topics that you'd like to be sure we put on the agenda for today? No, sorry, but did I hear December? Did I say December? Maybe? I it's, think so. <laughs> oh, May. this is May the 20th. Thanks very much, Bruno. So 20th of May, 2022. If I'm losing it, that's been an interesting day at the White House. We woke up this morning to no hot water. So, all okay. right. Anything else that needs to be on the agenda? Okay, quick quick overview, one open action item that isn't gonna get any, any attention probably for a month or more at least. We've got plugin installation manager documentation that an initial pull request had been submitted to www.jenkins.io trying to describe more use cases. The use case descriptions were flawed in there, but the concept made sense to us. But then we discussed with Tim and agreed that the best thing to do is put a very simple use case on www.jenkins.io and detailed documentation on the GitHub repository so that it's changed whenever we change, make submit pull requests to that code. Next topic was we're generally moving low, low volume mailing lists like the docs sig mailing list and the platform sig mailing list to community.jenkins.io to use a forum. Uh, any objections from any of you here, if we make this change, what I'll do is make that mailing list read only with a tombstone message on it that says, hey, post your question or your comment to community.jenkins.io. I assume there's been like no messages this year. I don't think I'm a, I'm a member of it. Yeah, so, or so, very, very low message volume, uh, low readership, and uh, therefore low value. Let's uh, let's put it on, let's centralize. I wasn't even aware it existed, so. <laughs> Ex exactly, and that's, that's one of those, okay. Chat will continue in Gitter because, because it's, it's at least somewhat active. All right, so next topic is require Java 11. So January, January, June 21 of 2022 will be the first re weekly release of Jenkins that will no longer support Java 8. Uh, Java 11 is it beginning then. So we've got an upcoming blog post from Basil Crow. Uh, we've had discussions. We've got the Jenkins enhancement proposal that's outlining it. We're still working through some issues with relatively low volume plugins and their use of Jaxby, but it, it's actually looking quite attractive. Most of us have been running Java 11 for an extended period. Any concerns here from you as platform SIG attendees with, with that or that need to be flagged to anybody? Good. Next milestone then will be the September 2022 LTS that will be the first LTS release to require Java 11. Is there and, a blog post com coming soon? Yes, so Basel's, Basel's preparing a blog post that we hope within the next week or so. He was working on it yesterday, he reported in the docs office hours that he was working on it already yesterday. Okay. And in docs sig, we had what, what we identified was there are four, four docs related topics. Kevin Martins is going to take two of those topics and Basel's taking two of those. One of them, one of the two is the blog post. The other is an upgrade guide and the upgrade guide will be a part of the blog post initially because we need it for weekly uh, as much as we need it for, for the September LTS. Any other questions related to the required Java 11 epic? 
So I like, I like how Basel structured this for us. What he shows is, okay, so here's the Java 11 blog post. Here's the Java 11 upgrade guide. And then he identified these two things for Kevin, user documentation and packaging documentations that Kevin Martins is working on from the documentation side. Okay, good. All right, so next topic then for me was Java 17 support. And right now we're in preview. I've not seen any, any no serious complaints or concerns. Just that it needs more test time. Now, I, und I do understand from Basel that there are, um, there may still be some tooling that is in progress. I don't recall the exact details. Much of the tooling has, go ahead, Tim. It was covered in the last session. Oh, it was, oh, good. Okay, so that was last week or two weeks ago when we met here. Oh, here we, here we go, got it, okay. 4.40 is enough, good, okay. Yeah. Nothing's changed since the last session as far as I know. Great, all right. That covered all the topics that I had. Any, any other topics, Tim, that come to mind for you or Alex for you, Bruno? Not on my side, thank you. Nothing for me, just trying to hop back in a little bit more. <clears throat> thank you, Alex. Well, and on the Windows side, thanks for your, your enhancements to the Windows installer to tell people more bluntly that Java 8 is going away. It's fun to do. <laughs> All right. Okay. I think that covers our topics for today then. If there are no other topics, I'd say let's go ahead and call an end to the session. Thanks very much for being here. Thanks, Mark. Good to see you.